Hey all fit here, how are you today? Well today is Tuesday, the 4th of August, it's a sunny and hot day, bye bye July, hello August. We are going to check pages from uh, exam Isimaisa 58 and 59. Remember you have to hand in today uh, the brainstorming from uh, chapters 5, 6 and 7 from the side of 4. And then the three minutes video explaining those uh, chapters five, six, and seven. Uh, we are going to check um, what well, this is from the M. Yes, it's already here. Yes, I will erase there from there. We are going to check yes, uh, exam maximizer that is there in the first part. Uh, then we are going to work with page uh, on page ninety-eight. Yes, from the class book. Yes, okay, and we're going to revise indirect speech now in the first part, and then we're going to revise report. You have to study for the revision on unit seven, eight, and nine. Yes, here is the note. Yes, write composition number seven, 16, 16 from the list, from the quadernillo, and write the last, the end, the brainstorming of, ch of chapters eight, nine, and 10, plus the three minutes video explaining the chapters, okay? Is it clear? Those um, scores, yes, okay, will go for uh, Literatura Complementaria Segundo Cuatrimestre, the second, uh, second term, okay? And you have to do pages 56, 57, 62, 63, 70, 71 from the sign of four. Yes, that are the activities, yes, the activities you have, yes, at the end of every, yes, at the end of every unit, a chapter, sorry. Then you have to do exercise uh, one and two, no el tres, one and two, yes, one and two, well, here, one and two from page 59, one Start with the writing because one and two is from use of English is done for today. So from the part of writing, you are going to do one and two because you will warm up um, how a report is um, written. Okay, so you will have an idea here. All right, exercise three, no. Well, shall we go and check everything? Yes, all right. Let's go, 58 and 59, we have many things to do, 58 and 59, yes, from the exam maximizer, okay, 58, grammar, 58, 58, okay, sci-fi director Ken Smithitz said that as human, humans, we were obsessed with the future. Yes, it's in present simple, goes to past. Number two, he said that it had taken, yes, the sentence was in past, past go, goes to past perfect, have taken 14 years before the use of mobile phone, have become or became widespread. Yes. Number three, the reporter said that TV reality show reflected, reflect was in present, goes to past, reflected society, society's fascination with celebrity. Number four, Ken reported that most of the film's predictions hadn't come true yet. Exercise five, the scientist asked, whether he really wanted to mess with our mind. Six, she told me she was sure that there was, there is, pasa, there was, plenty to come from the imagination of script writers. Is it clear? Um, another thing that I didn't put here is that you need to 
um, today I will put here, check your corrections. Yes, this is very important. I have sent all your corrections from the holiday homework. So I am very interested, yes, in uh, the fact that you see your corrections. Yeah? I te pongo acá holiday homework. Esta, si no chequean, no va a tener sentido todo el trabajo que hicieron. Hay muchas faltas, hay mucha gente que no entregó y hay gente que entregó y de verdad, yes, it is amazing, amazing, Teresita, Fran, Paula, uh, Nazarena, yes, uh, todos los que entregaron, inclusive eh, Martín, lo tuyo está mejorando, pero no me dejes renglones, por favor, ya dijimos en todas las clases que se deja sangría, para cuando vas a empezar el segundo párrafo, igual cuando vas a empezar el primero, dejas un espacio desde el margen, ¿sí? Así, eso se llama sangría. Cuando vas a empezar el segundo párrafo, volvés a dejar ese margen y todo lo que es aparte del margen, en la primera línea va a ir el margen, pero aparte ya desde abajo comenzás sobre el margen, ¿está? Sangría, no me dejes más arreglo. Eh, otra cosa, eh, well, eh, Iván, sí, todos los que entregaron, yes, Santi también, todos los que entregaron, muy buenos resultados. Eh, Otra cosa, bueno, eh, agre le agregaste más conectors, Martín, sí, se nota que tiene más conectors, pero agregarle más vocabulario, porque está pobre el vocabulario, ¿está? Entonces, eh, mejoró en la grammar pero se me des, hay un desfasaje ahí en la parte de spelling, ¿está? No sé, como eso es, siempre hay cosas que persiguen, según el writer. Entonces, en este caso, Martín, controla otra vez la parte que te persigue siempre a vos, que es la parte de spelling, porque había uno que tenía cuatro grammar, si no me equivoco, entonces, de grammar está bien, pero se va a mucho en la parte de, eh, de spelling, por ejemplo, ¿está? Entonces, ahí empieza a bajar, ¿sí? Eh, bueno, los demás tienen... Todas las correcciones están muy buenas. Hay unos escritos divinos, eh, muy buen vocabulario, muy buen uso de estructuras, very good use of connectors, vocabulary. Uh, I'm very proud. I'm very proud. Yes, so please check the mistakes of holiday homework. Yes, open the file and revise what I have corrected. Because if you don't revise what I have corrected, it's... Uh, It hasn't got sense, yes, okay, good. Well, uh, number one had been doing from page 58. Two, two had interviewed, three had been taken, taken, five would start, four was going to be, six didn't know, seven was, eight had been. Number three. Jackie, ojo que acá hay que pasar en los comentarios, eh. Jackie said she was planning to take her school exams and then go to college for three years. She said she would really like to study art history. Number two, Jim said, ese edad puede o no estar, eh. Jim said, pa, pa, pa. Jim said he could probably go to drama school for a couple of years and then audition for parts of te on television. Simon said, puede o no estar el that, his dream was to be a racing driver in Formula 1, one, like Lewis Hamilton. He said he had been doing a lot of karting recently and he had won a lot of prizes. So he thought that maybe one day his dream could come true. ¿Es clear? Let's go to use of English. El tema en esto es que quiero que, si hiciste mal, controles ese tiempo con tu cuadrito de tiempos. A esta altura, in fifth year, the changes must be here. Not, you don't have to read. Por otra parte, todas las personas que no entregaron, yes, uh, you have been very responsible. Recuerdo, entrego me voy puliendo. No entrego, me quedo atrás. Yes? Ok? Don't be behind. Behind. Yes? Ok? 
Don't stay behind. Yes, that was the expression I wanted to say. Okay? Insects meet rice. Number two. How? Two. With? Come up with? Number three. Them? Number four. If? Go? Number five. In? Number six. Or? Number seven. That? Number eight. Been? Yes? Okay, and that's all. All right? So let's go very quickly now. Yes, I will tell you, uh, for those who did it, yes, because I think um, 36. Actividades sobre la short story, 36. Yes, 36 and 37. Yes, 36. Oh, 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 oh. and 37 wait. wait a minute okay well so uh, put the sentences in the correct number from 1 to 6 esto te ayuda para organizar tus ideas para el brainstorming number 1 a well 1 a perdón 1 a6, B2, C5, D3, E1, F4. Okay? Well, number one, called Ann Watson Search Bartolomeo Scholto's Room. Number two, Inspector Arrives with Tadeo Scholto. Scholto. Yes, okay. And then um, D. Inspector Lestray arrests Tadeo Sholto. Yes. Four. Watson takes Miss Mortsan home to Camberwell. Yes. Number five. Watson goes to Lab Lambeth to find the dog Toby. Yes. Is it clear? And number six. Holmes and Watson follow Toby through the street of nowhere. Yes, okay, number two. B true, C true, D false, E false, F true, G true. Yes? Okay, number two. Yes, all right, that was number two. Well, the crossword. Candles. Punish. I will show you. These are the words. Yes? Okay. Candles, punish, thread, associate, drain pipe, introduce, attack. Yes, okay, introduce, drain pipe, uh, attack, attack. Ojo que se me pasaron, eh, se me pasó el crayon, el highlighter, eh? Yes, okay, exercise two, drain, B, drain pipe, C, punish, D, candles, E, attacks, F, associates, G, thread, 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 H, introduce. Okay, well. So let's go to pages 42 and 43, 42 and 43, are you there? B, 2, C, 1, D, 2, E, 3, E, 2, F, 1, and G, 3. Yes, okay? Uh, the word, word, work, work. B, co, C, lounge, D, leader. E exhausted and F committed. <coughs> Sorry. Guess what? Okay, arrives at Baker Street with 10 or more other boys. Wiggins. B. Ask the Baker Street boys to find the Aurora. Holmes. Is not found? More the cave. Takes Toby back to his owner. Watson. 
is worried about Sherlock Holmes, Mrs. Hudson. Okay, so let's go to page 48 and 49. 48 and 49. Good. B. The boys are dressed in dirty clothes. C. Uh -huh, the Aurora is a black boat. Uh, um, search the banks. E. Jonathan's most associate kills people with poison thorns. F. People from the Andaman Islands are very short. Yes. G. Watson. Watson fall asleep in his chair. H. Watson decides to visit Miss More, Miss More son Camberwell, in Camberwell. And Miss Mortson is worried about Tadeo Sholto. J. Holmes talked to himself in a strange, in a strange way. Work, work. Yes. B. Disappointed. Native. C. Uh, cannibals. F. Perdón. B. Disappointed. C. Cannibals. D. Thrilled. E. Native. F. Delayed. G. Muttering. Yes. Guess what? A4, A4, Holmes spent the night walking around the bedroom. B1, Watson, Watson takes a cab to Camberwell to report the latest news to Miss Morton. C5, Inspector Lestrade realized that Thaddeus did not murder his brother. D2, D2, an old sailor brings Watson news of more the case meet and the Aurora, the Aurora, E3, Holmes, Watson, and Lestred board uh, a police lounge at Westminster. Westminster, yes? Okay, that's all. Bye-bye. These activities really help you to understand the story. Yes? Okay, you're almost there. Well, good. Uh, let's go to another activity we have to do here. Yes, wait a minute. That is 80. There we go. Wait, wait, wait. I want you to go, I want you to go to page 80, page 80. In your short story, page 80, and I want you to uh, open page 80 from the copy because we are going to do exercise four that is reported speech. Yes, page 80. Yes. Okay. Wait a minute. some minutes and you have to write the sentences again but this time you have to use reported speech yes is it clear so read the sentences at home yes and I want you to uh, turn the sentences into indirect speech for example I know a dog that will be able to follow the smell of a top said Holmes Holmes said Holmes said that he knew a dog that could be able to follow the smell of a fox. Yes, okay, good, wait a minute. There we are. Yes, do it, while I am doing, while I am looking for something, yes, 
Okay, I want you to continue. Ready? Okay. The thing is I have um, prepared to project it there. Yes? Okay. There we are. Are you there? Good. Good. Number one. Number two. Because one is done. Letter B. There is a dead body, yes, and some valuable treasure has disappeared. Well, whenever you have uh, you have a sentence in indirect speech, the first thing you have to do is to highlight the tense. For example, here there is the grammar has disappeared, and we have less trade. Less trade. Yes. Okay. So we are going to start less trade. Said that puede o no estar. There is, is, pasa, a was, muy bien, there was a dead, pa, 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 body and some valuable treasure had, yo no escribo todo porque tengo presente el simple, pasa a, pasado perfecto, disappeared. Is it clear? Yes, so, you highlight, is, pasa, a was, present perfect, pasa, present, pasa, pas, Present perfect, pasa, past perfect. You have to take Miss Mortson home. Wasn't said. Yes? Okay. No, a person. Perdón. Uh, home wasn't. Said home. So, home, Holmes, tall, Watson, that he tiene que Tenía que, muy bien, he had to, he had to take Miss Mortson home. Is it clear? Entonces, have to, pasa a have to. Yes? If you don't go away, if you don't go away, my dogs, yes, if you don't go away, I'm in D. Yes? Okay, D. If you don't, Go away, my dogs, pa, 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 te atacan. Ok, ¿dónde estamos? I go away, presente, go away, don't go away, will, pasa, would, present simple, pasa, pas, yes, ok. Entonces, vamos. ¿Quién dijo? Sherman, Sherman, Tall, Watson, That 
if he didn't go, didn't, didn't go away, his dogs, ojo ahí en ese cambio porque su perro, él le dijo, his dog could attack, will, pasa, would, attack him. ¿Está? Que lo atacaría. ¿Es it clear? Yes. Ok, good. Holmes, vamos acá. I found the bag of thorns. The, mother, the murderer dropped it when he left. Said Holmes. Ho, bueno, found. Pass, pasa, pass, perfect. Dropped, pasa, pass, perfect también. Left, pasa, pass, perfect. Said Holmes. Ok, vamos. Holmes said that he had lost and found a bag of thorn. The murderer had dropped it when he had left. Is it clear? Yes, entonces. Por eso puse para proyectar esto, porque lo que me interesa es que veas y que vayas haciendo paso por paso. Marco el tiempo y después me pongo a hacer indirect speech. Si hay yesterday y todos los adverbios, ya saben los cambios, pero lo importante es highlight the tense and then remember the changes. ¿Es it clear? And then pay attention, obviamente, si él le dijo a él que cambiara su ropa porque estaría en su casa, por ejemplo. ¿Es it clear? Bueno, y me queda otra que no voy a escribir ahí. <coughs> um, Holmes said that Shorter had lived happily in Norwood until a letter had arrived from India. And G. Holmes said that Small hadn't killed Bartholomew, but his associate was a dangerous man. ¿Está? Well, so that was um, a revision from uh, indirect speech, yes, okay, using um, the short story. Shall we go to, <coughs> sorry, page 98, page 98 from the class book. This is the only page we are going to do now. And we're going to uh, revise how to write a report. Is it clear? Right. Shall uh, we go to page 166? 166. Seven, 67, sorry, 167. Yes, okay. There we go. Put the date, please, in all the pages. Excuse me, I have to erase this because that would be good for the pizarra. Uh, 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 uh. I need a bigger board. Yes, okay. Good. That's great. Good. Well, shall we go to a report? So, whenever you write a report, remember, remember, you have to go to 167. Yes, and remember the report. Yes, okay. You have to give a title to your report. It must be catchy. Yes. En el copete, que es lo que va abajo del, 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 uh, from the title, is under the title, you must uh, state the purpose, the aim of the report. Yes, okay. Is it clear? The aim of this report is to comment on the course at Edwards Language School in the UK this summer. 
And then you have subheadings, subtítulos, the course, accommodation, school facilities, social problem, conclusion. So, which is going to be the language you are going to use? It could be formal language, formal language. So, it means that you can't use abbreviation. Yes, okay. Then... Refer to numbers and amounts. Yes, okay. All the fa all the host families were kind. Yes, da 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 da. Yes. The school is quite pa pa pa. Seven classrooms. Yes. There's a computer. Yes. It can a cafe one cafeteria. Yes, okay. Is it clear? And then you have to finish with a conclusion and a recommendation. Yes? Okay? So you can recommend here when you conclude, yes, your um, report. Yes? Is it clear? And then you have the useful language there. The aim of this report, yes, the purpose of this report is to inform people about... Yes, a famous um, resort, yes, in Cancun, for example. In conclusion, to sum up, generally speaking, I would uh, recommend it, yes, okay. Is it clear? La idea es si te cuesta usar conectores, ir usando diferentes, uno nuevo en cada composición que te voy pidiendo. Is it clear? Yes, okay. Well. De más está decir, muy, muy bueno, muy bueno, culturalmente eh, estoy hablando de eh, el contenido que, tiene, eh, que tienen ¿sí? las composiciones que escriben. ¿sí? Se nota que son chicos buen, bien informados, que son leídos, ¿sí? hay muy buen nivel con respecto a los writings. ¿sí? So, congratulations. So, we're going to go to page 98, and uh, at this time of the class, I want you to speak along at home. Imagine you were, uh, you are here, yes, okay, and you have to talk. And it says, uh, how do you think people will spend their free time in the future? Well, we have already talked in other classes about the future, but this, uh, this, uh, but this time, I want you to think about the different activities um, people will do in the future. Will the activities be very different different to those uh, people do today? Yes, okay, think about all the activities uh, people will do in the future, yes? Okay, do you think, you, do you consider uh, people will continue going to the parks, people will continue uh, watching TV, yes, okay, uh, do you think people will continue riding their bikes, do you think people will continue swimming, going to the beach, walk, yes, uh, do you think people will continue traveling abroad, so, Nowadays, if I have to say, yes, um, <coughs> if I have to go back um, 20 years, uh, I'm 40, 20 years in the past, yes, I, um, I think this, yes, I will um, have never imagined, yes, that uh, we could be in this situation, yes? For example, uh, staying at home, um, having a limited time for going out, yes? And um, uh, seeing many people who are dying, yes? Uh, seeing um, many people who are looking for an answer, looking for a medicine, yes? to stop uh, this illness, yes, I yes, wouldn't have imagined this uh, thing happening. 
So now I want you to think, uh, if you have to, um, uh, think about this. No, you know, we are having these uh, moments in our houses. Yes, we are staying in our home. Yes, so how, if this continue, because I think in the future, there would be more illnesses, more pandemias. So uh, do, how do you think people will have fun? Yes, how do you think people will uh, communicate, uh, you know, replace, if we can say this, replace the time, yes, um, we uh, share with friends, for example, but do you think we are going to replace this time doing a video conference? Yes. Uh, do you think people will continue going to places, going out? Yes. What about the drinks that people are used to um, uh, having after working? Yes. After having a very uh, hard day of doing many things. Yes. Uh, what about the moments that we spend with friends face to face? Um, what about the activities we do to keep fit, for example? Not only free time activities, but think about it at home, yes? And talk for some minutes, yes? Okay, and then again, what leisure activities can people do in your area? Well, here we can go to the river, we can do uh, water sports, yes? Um, uh, we can swim, we can go to clubs, yes? Um, what sport or what leisure activity we can go camping to uh, we can go to herradura to the cottages there uh, which activity would i recommend i would recommend going to um, the riverside yes uh, you don't need uh, much money to go there you can work, um, walk along the riverside because it is quite long yes you can breathe um, fresh air, but be careful with the time that you choose because, you know, mosquitoes from uh, six, more or less, mosquitoes are a disaster. Yes, a big disadvantage if you want to go there. Uh, on the other side, so on the other hand, you can go uh, to pubs because we have some pubs now in Formosa. Uh, you can drink something, you can drink uh, a drink, you can take a drink, you can drink coffee, some tea, uh, some milkshake, or go to an ice cream shop, yes? Or maybe the cinema. But if, if I am talking about out, outdoor activities, I would recommend going uh, to the riverside, going to um, a pub if you want to go, uh, if you want to go, uh, if you want to do an indoor activity and uh, going to the cinema. That could be a very good idea if you want to have fun with some friends, yes? Okay, so now we are going to read the uh, exam question and the report. Which places could you like to go? Yes, okay? Um, well, read the introduction, restaurants, films and theater, sports conclusion, yes? And then tell me if you would like to go, think at home, if you would like to go to uh, the restaurants, if you would like to go to the cinema or theatre, sports, yes, okay. Uh, I would like to go to the cinema, yes, okay. Um, and it says there are two cinemas. Audi Cinema show all the latest films, Why Harvest shows all the modern. I, I would try to go one Friday to um, Audi Cinema. And on the other Friday, I will go to Harbour, yes? Because I am interested in watching classic movies, yes? Or films, yes? And, um, well, and then you call, I wouldn't, I wouldn't like to go to a Maverick Theatre because I don't like anything that is amateur, yes? Okay? Um, Well, yes, I, I could go there. I could go there because it says Ma the Maverick Theatre produces plays, yes, both amateur and professional. Yes, I was wrong there, yes. Okay, I would like to go there 
to see some uh, professional place, no amateur, yes? Some professional place. Uh, and uh, you are lucky because you are a student and you can pay less, okay? Well, as I chose uh, film and theater, you know, this part is for writing, for reading all about writing, how to do a report and everything, and um, for speaking. So you must speak at home, yes, okay? Choose one and say why, as I have said, okay? And then we're going to do exercise four, yes, exercise five, okay? Do exercise four and five. Now is the time that you pause the video, do the activities and then listen to the answers. Number four, to outline. Number two, while. Number three, it's worse. Number four, alternative, alternatively. And number five, the A. Number five, 1A, 2B, 3C, 4B, 5A, okay? So if you have to talk about, uh, if you have to invent a social program, yes, suppose we have a language school and other people are coming to this school, but we have to um, build, yes, a kind of social um, right, yes, uh, all the things a person who comes fr uh, from another place, a person who, who comes, sorry, uh, from another city can do, can do. So uh, it could be a social program. So I want you to think about all the activities we can introduce in this social program, okay? If you have the possibility to organize this social program, Yes, we have to think about all the cultural things this person could do, all the sporting and sporting activities. Yes, sporting, sporting activities, and we can add leisure activities. Yes, okay. Oh my God, good. Is it clear? Well, so, what cultural activities, yes, okay? Do, do, will they have the possibility to see, yes, or uh, see plays, yes, at a theater, for example? Uh, will they have the possibility to um, perform in amateur um, plays at the theater? Yes, okay. Uh, will they have the possibility to go to any kind of, um, um lessons as regard uh, theater lessons i mean what possibilities what uh, sports can they practice will they have to pay for a fee the, will they have discounts yes okay um as here in the reductions in the payment yes okay uh reductions in the fee i mean what sports Water sports, uh, what? Gymnastic, they could be outdoor or indoor. I think outdoor could be better because in Formosa, the majority of the days are, you know, hot and sunny. Yes, so that could be great. Um, we have to choose, you have to choose what activities, what sport they could be there. Yes, and at what time they could be possible. Yes, and where, yes, the same here. What about leisure activities? I think that we can um, we can uh, put, for example, uh, we can set a day, Saturdays and Sunday could be free, but we are going to organize camping, yes, okay, um, going camping, going on a kind of expedition, uh, going on a treasure hunt, for example, yes, okay, good. So that could be, uh, this is for you to talk because this warm you up before writing a report, for example. That was all, yes, okay. Think about all the homework, study for the revision unit six, seven, eight, and nine. Please, this is the end of the sign of four. Do the activities, do the activities from the pages, from the uh, sign of four, like it's done in a libro, because they will help you to understand more, you know, the, um, the story. This is the end, yes, and that would be all from the 
uh, second term from literatura complementaria, do composition number 16, study for a revision, yes, remember to do the brainstorming, chapters 8, 9, and 10, record what is it about, yes, okay, and then um, do page 59, only exercise 1 and 2, not 3, not the writing, because you have one writing here that is composition 16 from the quadernillo. Yes, okay? Please check your corrections. Check, really check your correction because, uh, you know, I work a lot in the corrections. I work um, on the corrections, okay? See you next class, okay? Bye-bye.